It is smoking out here on the bench today. That's because we've got two young, smart, brilliant, upcoming politicians. And yes, they are politicians. Mweshimiwa Kenokoth from Kibra. He's the man on the far end and the man in the middle. In fact, Mweshimiwa Okoth said, this man in the middle will become the next MP from Nyeri Town. His words, not mine. Anyway, we'll see. Kunjiru Wapoko is in the house. Folks, keep tweeting at Okoth Kenneth, at Kunjiru Wapoko, at Kunaga Jeff. The hashtag politics 101 gentlemen right before the break i said let's talk about code when we come back so let me preempt this whole thing yes a couple of weeks ago weta senator moses butangula yes has his bash coming out bash yes. invites baba baba doesn't show up baba's on his way to tanzania boom okay weta's not very happy a couple of days later baba's back he kind of explains the whole thing a few days ago a memo comes out of nowhere and says there was an mou between wiper and ODM saying if Baba won in 13, he'd serve for one, well, one term and then hand over to Kalonzo. The way I see it, I, I could be wrong here. I think Weta is out in the cold. By the way, I asked him to come on the show t today. Yes. Maybe he needed permission to come on. I don't know. But uh, <laughs> I think he, he said to invite on, on, on a separate show. He said, <laughs> he said to What's the question? What do you want to know? The question is, is Cord in Discord or, or are you all cordless? No way. We are in one accord. A C C O R D. We are in one accord. We are united, and that's our formula to kicking Jubilee out in 2017. To send them home by eight o'clock in the morning. You don't believe that. You, 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 yes. I mean, even he doesn't believe that. You can see. You, you can see. He has struggled. I okay. know. I mean, I know I'm he has struggled. I, I, I know he has out an English has, word to you no, 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 because no, no, no. you know cordless. You know you discord. Yes. Yes. Let me add one word on. for you. Go on. You know a cord. A C C O R D. I mean, just compare how you were national anthem. Compare how you were talking. Let me give you a substance. I doubt. Yeah. You know genuineness. No, no. Let me finish. Go on, Rose. Finish up. Listen. I just given you my thesis. Yeah. Let me give you the point. Go on. We are united. That's our way to victory. You don't sound Number and you don't look united. <laughs> Forget about looks. In the US primary right now, Trump is running his he has opponents, mm -hmm. Cruz, you've got Governor Casey, mm -hmm. Hillary Clinton. It's not being through uh, you know, it, it's not a coronation. She had to go a nomination. Bernie Sanders is doing a run for her money, including in New York <laughs> State where they're voting tomorrow. So it's never that easy. It's what we're having in court now. It is healthy democracy. Let everyone de declare. We're not uniting into one party. We are one coalition. Each party has to be very strong. Remember to win. Whichever candidate eventually we mm -hmm. slot as our flag bearer has to win in Western. He has to win in Turkana and the northern counties. He has to get votes in the coast. He has to get votes in Ukambani. He has to get <coughs> votes in Nyanza. He has to get votes in Nairobi. So that is a very serious coalition making process. Not one person can win by themselves. So whether it's Raila who is you know, right, for central, to, huh? I'm telling you. <coughs> No, no, you were part of our strategy. Sorry, you didn't sorry, deliver any I mean, votes from sorry, Central. Sorry, 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 oh, sorry, sorry, you, you fight right. for your nearest seat. He, he worked for you guys. Didn't talk about cord issues. <laughs> you fight for your nearest seat, which is the best. As a mole, I was nah, no, no, that, that's irrelevant. You fight for your nearest yeah. seats on issues yes. and come to Parliament but, and make good laws for Kenya. Mm -hmm. On cord issues, yes. you know nothing. Okay, I'm inside. I hear your MP for the Raila Prime Minister. Okay. Well, yeah, Moses Kuria. Okay, real quick. Is he the front runner? He's a front runner, of course, but we have got quality players. We are, we are at, a, you know, we are. Uh, how do I say? We are woefully blessed. The, you know, the yes. woefully blessed. Yes. Woefully blessed. Nice. In German, in German, in they years. call it yeah. the Qual der Wahl. We are spoiled for choices. We suffer ah, for spoiled. having to choose. Boys, I like if we yeah, lost yeah, any yeah, one of them, yeah, yeah. Right. the other could run immediately. Okay, well, hold that thought. Experience could you re could do the could job. Could so, I need to uh, get in here. Uh, okay, you want us <coughs> to be divided? We will not no, no, be divided. No, 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 no. And that is our formula to beat you. No, no. Jubilee, Jubilee would most probably Jubilee would appreciate an organized opposition. Unfortunately, God is not it. Kenyans would appreciate no, 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 I mean, that is organized no, no, and delivering no, no, I mean, on its manifesto. Can we, we talk about that? We are going to be the manifesto at that point. So Mwishmiwa. Mwishmiwa. I'll let you speak. I'm sorry for interrupting. We're talking about organization um, and, and s small things like that podium falling down a mm. couple of weeks ago. Right. This tells you the kind of disorganization we have in court right now. Now, what we're seeing, uh, the fight between Weta, Kalonzo, Raila, Raila Molo Dinga, and, and the, the whole idea of where you see Mudama and Orengo calling a press conference mm -hmm. and saying that Weta was never part of the MOU. And then you have Weta's people, Chris, uh, Dr. Chris Wamalwa, complaining that, look, as Watu, Watu Mulembe are going to leave. This is not, this is not a court. 
I mean, this is not even friendly competition. Because if you're using the examples of America, you're not seeing Hillary going to Sanders' uh, uh, um, campaign elections. Right. We saw Kalonzo go to Wetangulas. We saw Wetangulas saying he expected Raila to show up, and Raila did not come. So Raila trying to mumble and explain why he did not come. And this is where, this is the beginning of the end for court. I, 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 I wish it wasn't, yeah, but I do, not see, I do not see a yes. situation where, yes, where Weta is going to, Weta and Kalonzo and Raila are going to stay in this party. Let me, let me well, tell you why. Going to leave, aren't they? Let me tell you, yes. And let me tell you why. We ha they have only one position to share. There's only one position available, by the way. And, and there's Deputy, nothing no. for them to give Deputy me to believe. President, mm -hmm. not president. Mm -hmm. I mean, you'd have to be a child <coughs> to imagine that the presidential candidate for court is not Raila Molo Dinga. Wow. That's already given. It, so it, it's it, only it, the it, deputy it, president. Is that a given? Come on. You heard what Weta said the other day. Have he you says, seen? Have you seen? Why don't you step back? Wachilia Vijana. Young tax. Young tax. Yeah, I mean, that was just him. Him now trying to plead with this guy who has taken over all the space. Which, when is the last time you saw Kalonzo or Wetangula leaving the country to go to France or London or Germany or anywhere? I mean, it's only Raila who goes. What does that mean? Ah, but but sure. go. You see, Raila is an international leader. Ah, there you are. You see. So how do these now, guys now, come you know, yes, with him? Let me give I you think, how do the these principles. Guys come with him? You know, you're my elder brother. I respect you. We've worked together before and I wish you well. I disagree with some of the things you're espousing now, but I'll disagree respectfully. Okay. Can I tell you, mm. in politics, mm. power is never given. You take it. You create your space, you shove. Even on that podium where you think people are shoving mm. to get there, mm. it's like a rugby game. There's a reason and a rhyme to it. Fair, no? As you're entering this game now, I think NSIS will be proud of you. They even oh. threw tear gas at Weta, but he... No, 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 no. That's a Faraja, man. <laughs> you have no evidence. No, I mean, All I know in Kenya, yes. only state mechanisms and machinery has got tear gas. <laughs> but you know, he criticized us on the aesthetics. We could do some improvement there for sure. sure. Run things a little more professional, less shoving. But you know, our stage going down shows how popular you are that people want to be on that stage <laughs> that it can collapse. You number are, two, you number two, well, well, let me tell you, well on the presidential well side. Mm -hmm. Didn't you just hear the passing out parade for the GSU? The president twice had to walk. These soldiers had the AK-47, the magazine had fallen. He had to sure. stoop and you will roll with these things. Nothing's always picture perfect. You see the other guy marching, he kicks his head, leg, he falls. These things happen. Statecraft yeah. is not perfectly beautiful <laughs> like, you know, a Disney movie. No, so let, let us just say. But on a serious note, I can tell you, Cod, we are united. It's our only path to victory. And let us look at the full landscape, and then I hope you give us a chance to address why on substance mm. Kenyans will vote for God regardless of personality. Real quick, you know. Real quick. Yeah. Um, is Baba, is he the candidate? Is, is, it, is that a foregone conclusion? He's my preferred choice. He's he, preferred he, choice. He is my secret constituent. And Weta, of all. Weta has yes. to get his nod, his approval, his blessing, right? Yeah. To go anywhere. No. Of, of many people, not Raila's blessings as one person, but of, if of many culture, people. God is owned by a team. It doesn't belong to one person. It's a democratic team. It's contentious. It's a family. No family is perfectly harmonious. Absolutely. Look, you know, no, so no, I mean, we have to compete for that. Can he leave? Can we'll, he leave? Weta? Let me tell you, nobody can leave. You will stand together and win together, or you will separate and you hang alone. There's you nowhere to go. He talked about sharing of positions in court. Let's do some basic analysis. In Jubilee, if you were to leave, mm. any one of us to leave, mm. these three leaders, mm -hmm. to leave now, they're going to Jubilee. Mm -hmm. What position are you going to give them? I mean, you're going There's to no give it. Let, let me tell you. Let There's me ask no about, space in Jubilee. Are you There's expecting more rivals? No, 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 are you no, no, expecting no, no, more rivals? From the charity where? Gilus, the... Who's going to be the, going no, to no, a our position, man? is becoming smaller and smaller. It's going to end up three or four serious players and parties and entities. Is Weta one of them? Weta is a very credible leader. Yes. He's one of them. All the people who are dismissing him are making a mistake. This call reminds me of Hotel California. Win, and yes. and can you, I tell you, you something? You can check out, no, but I you was, can never leave. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> but I can tell you one thing. Yes. I think we must give Weta his respect as an as experienced leader, and he adds value to <coughs> ODM. He adds value to Wiper. He adds value to Cod as a whole. He adds value to Wiper. What if he works? So I would like to say any walks? leader out there who is dismissing him and insulting him is wrong. Shame on them. They need to take back no. work. Show respect mm -hmm. to him, mm -hmm. number one. Number two is when you ask about living, for instance, yeah. 
let's say anyone leaves, Uhuru leaves, Ruto, Ruto leaves, Uhuru. Who, how are you going to win in 2017 next year? You have to form a coalition. Nobody can win by themselves. So that I can tell you. But he didn't answer, no, no, you're not answering my question. Don't answer, don't answer, what if Weta works? Not if. What if Weta not if. works? If it will make things very difficult to us. Okay. Not if. Uh, when? When? He's working. He's no working. No. He's working. Let, let me explain working. to you why. You see, in a game of sport pressure, you want to bet how much? Unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, yes, Ken Okoth is not the one who is running court coalition. This is a sensible guy. Mm. This is a guy who is going to make sure Weta doesn't leave. But it's not him who is running that brothers. show. And the guys who are running it are not going to listen to him. And that's why you see a press conference done by Senator Orengo, done by Senator Muthama, that says that Weta is not part of the MOU in court. And can I tell you why I'm saying see, that position? No, no, let me, let me, and, 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 and this is not taken away from Ken. Sure. And this is the unfortunate thing about court. Court has some amazing and brilliant people within it. But unfortunately, the guys who lead it are not that brilliant. Mm. And that's why court is not going to win the next election. Not because they don't have capacity within them, but because the leadership that leads court will not allow the capacity within it yeah. to actually make the decisions. Hold, hold on, Moshua. Hold on, Moshua. Uh, Gonjeri. Yes. Moshua 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 walks. Yes. Where does he go? Where does he, he go? go? This is the advantage of Jubilee. Uh. You see, Jubilee is running government. They can give Weta so many things that court cannot give him. Weta can be given anything from a minister to ambassador to anything. What can they give him? Uh -huh. <coughs> can I come back Please. to you? Weta is not about an idea of a personality. He's a wealthy person like Nunjiri. He's not looking for power just for the sake of it. And so what I was telling you is, even Cod, Raila Odinga, Kalonzo Musioka, they can't be looking for this for the power and the powers. They have to look for it for an idea mm -hmm. beyond. Mm -hmm. Weta can't look for power for himself. He has to look for power saying, as a leader of this country, this is how I'll guide the country and this is how it will benefit the citizens. But are you just Anyone else who just comes for power for the sake of it yes. and we trivialize it, we do a disservice to the debate by making about these palace sure, games, sure. But about Moshua, the personalities, yes. rather than the issues. But you and must be disappointed. That you with. must be disappointed with the way your party yes. has treated this co principle right you Actually, must be disappointed i am disappointed but i'm not too distressed about it because also weta is a man mm. you don't get into politics without some fortitude eh, of a certain kind okay stuff will be said about you look at me three years ago i didn't have a single gray hair today i'm distinguished <laughs> and you're 38 a lot of things have been said about me a lot of things have been pushed are you running again? of course i'm running again are you serious i am not running i'm standing <laughs> <laughs> What if, what if Baba gives his daughter a direct nomination in Kibra? It's not going to work that way. Come on, what, what do you mean? It's worked that way in court before ODM? Look, I am standing for the Kibra seat. My name's going to be on the ballot. I'm going to be on an ODM ticket. I know what I'll do to win it because I have the ground support. It's not about me and power. It's about the service and the work and the value I bring to the people of Kibra, citizens of Kenya. It's about the value I bring serving in the National Assembly and pushing agendas that mark that all Kenyans mm -hmm. of all tribes. And I will be able to communicate that I'm confident very effectively to the people on the ground, to my party. I don't think my party thinks I'm a liability. I know my party, including the Prime Minister, Raila Odinga, knows I am an asset to the party that my record and work on the ground speaks to it. Yeah. And I'll fight for the nomination. I'm not asking for it to be handed. And so I think people <coughs> like, again, to malign the Odinga family. And I'll protect Raila here very clear to say you. Here's why, for instance, I'm talking about Weta. Why he must be respected and the debate must be conducted with decorum. Anyone inside court who is insulting Weta and saying he's dispensable is making a terrible mistake because Raila needs Weta to win. Mm -hmm. You kick out Weta, you diminish Raila's chances mm -hmm. of winning. You're hurting him. He's I making am the point. MP for Raila. I want Raila to win. For him to win, I must fight for all support I can get. Mm. I must get even people from Central, Germany, <laughs> to Saidiani, Kidogo, <laughs> to all, the best, Chiedi, all the best to our way to. So, so, so it is all very best important. Our and the same, if Weta wants to win, you don't win by chasing away Raila and his supporters. You win on the agenda, on ideas, and you show a formula in our country where you say, what are we standing on the issues? What are the undelivered promises? Five years of waste and I yeah. believe not a lot have they accomplished that they promised to accomplish and we must analyze that properly the state of yes, the nation one, one, one more thing before you reply one yes. more thing about baba yes. since you're defending him left right and center which is great which is fine when the icc came out with the decision yes. to terminate the case against dp ruto yes. and sang he was one of the first to congratulate dp ruto yes one of the very first yes today in paris yes. he comes oh. out 
and says something completely different. You saw what he says, right? This is a blow, or he says, you saw, you, Who's quoting that? Actually, him. no, it's him in, in, in that's Paris. Cited by who? He is you know, you are the country, These no. French reporters can report. No, oh. him. Say oh. him. Oh. Say him. 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 And then you have the quote, it's, it's, it's here. here. ODM, ODM party deploys collapse of ICC case against Ruto. France 24. Nah, France nah. Van Kat. You see, France 24. Then. But then he said it, my no, friend. No, no, no. He said it. I, yes. you, it's all, we can let's play let, it. Okay, here's, so let's talk about this. Eh? We'll play this during the break so I understand this. Okay. okay. But all I can tell you is, on the issue of ICC, we're not going to get justice through ICC. We must be clear on that. Let us now focus on delivering justice to Kenyans. And as long as I'm an MP of ODM and working with other ODM MPs and MPs in TNA and URP, mm -hmm. we must remember they are victims in this country. And the president last year in the State of the Nation said, we will put aside a fund of 10 billion for three years. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. For three years, which they already put aside 3 point something billion last year. Let us put in a law and an agency in place to do reparations for victims of post-election violence, for victims of historical injustice, the TJRC report. There are people in this country, a lot of time when we talk about victims, we think it is IDPs, your land, you are kicked out in Eldoret, here's a little bit of land somewhere in Nakuru or Naivasha, now we've sorted you out. That's not the same. There's people who are raped, mothers who are raped in 2008. Today their children in class are eight years old, then class one or class two. Yeah. How do you deal with justice for them? Okay. So, so that let us talk about things that save. And we can ask what is the court position on this? What's the jubilee position on it? Mm -hmm. We are all in government to yeah. serve Kenyans. What are we doing to meet those things? Okay. And I, even as we go to Afraha, it's yes. going to be important. So it's not okay. about we'll one talk, thing we'll that we'll you say, I will have said. No. More important is going, going forward for regular going Kenyans forward. to change we'll their lives. We'll talk about Afraha when you come back and break yes. But Gujiri, I need to make a point. I need to make a point. The, the problem, because I have worked with court, and the problem with court is that they don't listen to guys like this. Mm. And this is the saddest part about that. Why don't question. they listen to guys like this? Because they think guys like this are not in the struggle. Mm. There's this feeling within court that if you are not in the struggle, you know, in the 1992, yeah. you don't know anything about politics. So they're not going to listen to him. As and much sense as he talks. Exactly. And that is the saddest part about it. He's just told us that he doesn't believe that there's anything that is going to stop him from being member of parliament of Kibra. And he should be member of parliament of Kibra. I would love to be with this guy in parliament. The, only thing in parliament. Mm. the problem is this. One of the guys who's trying to run against him is hanging out with Baba in France. Right now. Right now. Trying to get that vote. Yeah. You see what yeah. I'm saying? And, and you see, and this is the problem. So, okay, I'm not complaining. So it's, it's good for position to stay as disorganized sure. as it is. Yes. Because they cannot run this country. But, but these people sad, are being wasted then. They're wasting people like this. I and I hope that I don't feel I hope I have served my country very well You're for three years and, and my country and my constituents very well yeah. with the position and privilege I was given yes. as a member of the parliament and I will continue to do that until the last day and I will seek re-election and I know my strategy and, and I can give him a guarantee yes. I can give him a guarantee yeah. if they mess you up Kokov We'll create space for you in Jubilee <laughs> and we'll take care of you, my friend. We need days like this. Us guys take care of, and of our, course, our brains. Jubilee. By the way, I can see you, Kenokov, Gujiru Wambogo, and Robert Alai in the next parliament. Alai is going to stand in Mbakasi, yeah, you know that? In Mbakasi, I saw that. I saw that. I can see you all. And he's most probably well, going to win gonna be in Mbakasi. And he's been very influential as a it's, blogger. Yes. Really. You know, do, oh. he's doing better than all the traditional no, no. media combined. His so, influence. Oh, Alai. He's powerful, influential, social media. and he's done important <laughs> things with it. So, Absolutely. Amazing. Let's take a break, come back, talk about Afraha, and a quick Jubilee scorecard. Yeah. Three years later, yeah. how have they done? I'm very well, you have your very well. <laughs> I brought my whistle. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, why didn't you whistle? Why didn't you whistle? Because I've got a platform like this. This is my whistling moment. I whistle in a language no, no, that Kenyans don't whistle understand. Here. I am speaking oh, to you oh, in a oh, language okay. you understand. Okay. I have okay. this platform. Yes. I every week I can I get a chance to speak to Kenyans so those guys, and engage on yeah. issues. Was that embarrassing? Those guys who are like whistling. Was that embarrassing? No, they can't go on TV. It was important. I mean, it was powerful. Okay. And uh, you know, in their sense, symbolically, you're raising an alert and saying, you know, the state of the nation is so bad that even if you kick us out of this parliament. We are warning you, Mr. President, change direction. We are going in the wrong direction. That's okay. a fair statement. We and we'll, the we'll president may no, okay, let's be honest. It yeah. was a bit silly. Okay. Uh -uh. This Good. is not the first On time we've been drama silly, no. Gentlemen, yeah. don't make me. Yeah. 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 At O'Clock Kenneth, at yeah. Kujiru Wambogo, at Kananga Jeff, the hashtag. Yeah. Politics 101. I tell you, man, these guys, they argue. They argue the points, and that's what we want.
because as I always keep saying, we got to keep talking. Because the moment we stop talking is the moment we start fighting and you don't want to go down that slippery slope. Let's take another break. Come back. Plenty more ahead. Jeff Kanange live at the Villa Rosa Kempinski. We'll be back in a...